Okay, so basically I didn't give any like explanation or introduction of what this video is about, so I'm going to do this now. Also, I know the audio in this video is going to be out of sync. I'm sorry, my computer is, you know, kind of old. Like her camera just doesn't like sync it or whatever. I promise like you don't have to look at this for, for a long time. I'll, I promise this video will go away soon. Anyways, I'm just going to be eating like food from my college and just showing you like what they give us. If you're looking to go to Emory or just college in general, this is like what you would eat in a week. So yeah, also sorry for my lisp. I do have my retainer in. Good morning, guys. You can tell it's the morning because I look like this, right? Um, I really have a really fancy um, breakfast every morning. I know you're probably going to be really jealous and maybe feel a little insecure because you'll be like, oh my god, why is this girl, like, why is her, this girl's breakfast game so strong? But it's okay, I promise, like, not everyone can, like, be like me and, like, you know, have such a fancy meal that is, like, really good for my body, okay? So, our main course of the deal is, of course, Captain Crunch because Captain Crunch is just the most healthy source of food. It has the colors of the rainbow, obviously. So you're getting your full food palette or whatever. After this, we go in with some lactose-free milk because your girl is lactose intolerant. And that's basically my breakfast. Super easy. I'm just... Ugh. I cannot cook well, but... I can make a mean cereal, if I do say so myself. I am not the best with time in the morning. I am insane with time in the afternoon. But just to balance out my amazing time management in the afternoon, I'm late for everything in the mornings. So I have to eat this really fast, and I'll catch back in with you guys later. Gotta get my salts out in case this food has no seasoning. So we got a few things today before I get into my story and start eating. So first we have some soup. It's called beef macaroni, so we'll see how that tastes. And then we have a salad and fries. This is teriyaki sauce. I don't even know why I got this. I'm not in the mood to eat fried food. I just thought this in case the soup is shit. And what I've learned here, and I'm sure what everyone else has learned, is you really have to, you know, get a lot of stuff so you have an increased probability of liking what you eat. But anyway, so this morning, I woke up and my stomach just was being a little bitch. It was hurting. It was like my gut. I went to the bathroom, obviously, and sometimes after I go to the bathroom, you know, it takes effort. So I was tired. And I've been tired ever since. Even though I took a 10-minute nap, I literally took a 10-minute nap for going to the bathroom, yeah. My life has literally gotten to that point. But even after that, I just, I don't know. It might be the food here. Mmm. Soup is absolutely busted today. Which is why I got two. Probably gonna take another nap after this. I am really taking a long time to recover from this little bathroom trip. And I don't know if it's me or the school. I'm gonna blame on the school. Also, a little life updates. Okay, if you watched this previous video right here, you know how we said, like, he's a catfish, right? Well, he's not. He just had to turn out to be real. He decided to text me last week. All boys are the same. They just always come back. As the arbitrator of truth that I am, I decided you do something bad, you get you get punished, okay? It's just karma. It just works like that. And I was like, okay, I'll be the karma. I just let him apologize all the time. And then I repeated how he annoyed me. And then I blocked him. I really just thought you guys should know. And don't worry, I inflicted, I think, the right amount of pain. So this is for the girls. Yeah. Okay, guys, for dinner, I got ramen. It has cucumbers and chicken and i don't know what this is in english but it's like doya yeah it's kind of chilly today so i thought it'd be the perfect thing to eat madison what'd you get tofu and rice Yummy. and broccoli with compound sauce wait how are the pancakes good you want one yeah mm -hmm. here you go oh, so oh good mm -hmm. here's the soy sauce <laughs> so italian <like> pancake <laughs> <laughs> This is how my mom makes them. They're good. Okay, guys, now we're eating dinner, and we're with Libby, and we're with Madison, but I'll block out your face if you want. That doesn't count as not putting me in the vlog <laughs> if you still show me. Okay, I'll put a, I'll no, put a black restart, screen. No, just restart, restart. Hey, guys, we're at dinner, and here's Libby, and we also have Madison, um, but she was not like, <laughs> Why are you just Hi, guys, we're at dinner, and here's Libby. It's just Libby, only me and Libby. <laughs> So I got this mashed potato and it hits. And I also got some green beans 
and then i had they gave me like four pieces of general tal's chicken that was really like you know stingy on their part but whatever i also had a pizza but i already ate it so sorry you can't see that but we have a cute little skyline tonight and it's finally warm enough where we can eat outside I haven't done this, but here so, I am. okay straight off the bat i'm gonna take doc off two points because there is a hair you can't see it there's a hair in my fruit, guys. Wait, this girl on my track team was telling me that she got like a panini one time and it like came with like so much hair in it. Yeah. Wait, yeah. really? But it was like last time. <laughs> no, I thought they all have hair nuts. Now I'm trying some apple pie. Libby said it was pretty good. Eating it with a knife. Mine's such a messy. Today is Thursday and I thought I would show you my lovely lunch. So basically first we got a trusty salad in case everything else tastes like shit. Next we have a cake that looks surprisingly good. We have uh, waffle fries because I'm on obviously such a healthy streak. Water and we have a grilled cheese that looks pretty good if I would say so myself but we can give it a try. So first we're gonna try the grilled cheese. I'm, this is like the first time Emery's had a grilled cheese bar, so this will be interesting. Basically the only thing I can taste is the tomato because it takes up like 50% of the sandwich. And the cheese is just not melted for some reason, but it's okay, you can't win them all, I guess. These are very crunchy. French fries are okay, but that's good for me because if they're not that good, then I probably won't eat all of them. And then I will not get high cholesterol. It doesn't look like it's from last semester. I just have such a great eye for cakes. And this cake definitely is much better than the other ones they've been giving us. This one is actually edible. It's not stale and super dry. Amazing, wow. She's really good. This one's bad because she's also really big salad is just a salad though i did forget the soy sauce for my egg so we'll let you know if i survive without the soy sauce but i don't think you guys need me to try a salad because it's probably like the most basic thing you could ever get here this is my little um lunch for today as you can tell they just spelled my name like so correctly they probably thought it was like some exotic chinese name or something because he literally he literally was like Ali and I was like, no. Then I got this egg and cheese uh, bagel, which was highly recommended by Madison. It's good. And it has just egg and on a bagel and a uh, cheese. And I got a matcha latte, which is really good. Madison got the same thing. <laughs> and a smoothie. Yes, but with a smoothie. Oh, this is really good. We're eating cake in this bitch. <laughs> we have an entire cake. cake. Because it's oh, wait, Jesse's birthday. Happy birthday, girl. Happy birthday. And the big event we're doing is homework to <laughs> celebrate. <laughs> Woo <-woo. laughs> Cookie crumbles. Wait. Guys, I have an amazing idea. Ice cream on the cookie. <laughs> I came to Emory for a reason, and this is the reason. Oh my god, it's so good with the ice cream. You guys have to eat this ice cream. Um, also at dinner today, you make sure it's all correct. I, I ate something bad, and I literally was on the toilet for like two hours. So now I'm hungry. <laughs> so this is my next meal. Okay guys, so that's basically the video for seeming like this month because I'm really swamped right now with just work and like extracurriculars and stuff. But I promise once I get the handle of things, I will try to post more. But I wanted to stop in and say thank you so much for 400 subscribers. I feel like my channel is growing so fast because I feel like it was just like a few months ago that I was saying thank you for 300 and the fact that I've already gained 100 subscribers in a few months is really insane to me because I think it took me around like two years to reach even 100. So thank you so much. It means so much to me. It's so crazy to me that 422 of you are subscribed to my channel because you like my videos. So thank you. It means so much and it mot really motivates me to post more for you guys. And I can't believe 2,000 people saw me get stood up for a date but it did get me some views. So just profit off your embarrassing moments in the future, guys. But anyways, yeah, thank you for subscribing. Thank you for watching. Thank you for liking and commenting. I read all the comments and I respond to all of them because they're just so sweet and nice and you guys are so great to me. Please don't try to shake things up a bit by leaving me comments because I will cry. But yeah, thank you for watching and I hope you have a great 
morning or evening or lunchtime or bathroom break whenever you're watching this but yeah all right i'll see you next time whenever that is